The two network providers in the country, Swazi MTN and Swazi Mobile, have assured the nation not to worry about difficulties of network congestion during the crossover. In the past, users of Swazi MTN networks have encountered difficulty in making calls during the night of the crossovers. Phones only became functional in the early hours of the morning. The communications officer for Swaziland's newest mobile network provider, Swazi Mobile, Mark Fort Sibanze, says efforts have already been made to guarantee that their customers are able to use their network during all times of the day. We had a booster, which we still have at the trade fair. So on the big day where we are directly involved with a festival that is going to have quite a number of high attendances, so there will be no network glitches. Same thing with the Sibayeni event that we have. Again, we're going to use a booster that is around the Matsapa corridor, which is going to make our network easy. We're looking at the country in general, in all the spaces where there will be congestion in a form of people partying in churches, you name it. Swazi MTN communications officer Manla Luponvo, speaking to us on the phone, says the issue of network congestion has been adequately dealt with and there will no longer be a problem. He further added that new network towers have been erected at different points all around the country to ensure a nationwide network coverage. The only problem he outlined was the likelihood of a power outage caused by thunder and lightning. Reporting for Swazi TV, I'm Spesi Kumalo with Gianim Sibi and Smuva Shongwe.